Easter Day Story. Goliath was humming quietly in the yard. Just do it, Trevor and Trevor. All right, Bill and Ben. Are you sure he won't mind, though? He won't mind. He likes when we do it. Okay. Ouch! <laughs> Trev, Trevor, what are you doing? I suppose he did mind. Valerie, how could you let them do that? What are you talking about? You didn't defend me. I'm sorry, Goliath. Stop the yelling. What is it, Marina? The fat controller has something to say. Goliath, Valerie, I would like to introduce to you a brand new tank engine. Her name is Maria. Hello, everyone. She's come to help with the Easter preparations at the party later today. Goliath, Valerie, you must show Marina the way of Soto while pulling the train. I can do this on my own, said Goliath. Wait, said Valerie. Is that Goliath? Yes, said Valerie gravely. He's the one we have to watch out for. Goliath backed down onto the train. He waited for Maria to shunt it. Ouch! Watch it, said Goliath. Sorry, giggled the trucks cheekily. Maria giggled too, and she puffed backwards. Now I have to get moving quickly. I don't want to work with any engines who won't help me. I want to help you, said Valerie. Let me come along. No, thank you. I can manage just fine all on my own. Suit yourself, said Valerie. Her feelings were hurt. I will manage on my own. I'll pull the train with no delay and no issues in between. And Goliath started away quick as a cat and no delay and ready to go. Woo! He whistled out of the station. The other engines were speechless. <laughs> I had better follow him, said Valerie. I have to make sure he is all right. No, I'd better follow him, said Maria. I can do it. I'll take a flatbed, she whistled. I'll follow him up the hill. Then he'll stop when he sees me. You think he will, said Valerie. I know he will, said Maria confidently. Maria followed him up the track, and Valerie was right behind her. Goliath arrived to the bridge. Stop, said the workman. We're not sure if the track ahead is safe after the storm the night before. So please take care and be mindful of the track ahead. Don't worry about me, smiled Goliath. I'll do just fine. We're just trying to make sure you're safe, said the workman with the hurt arm. I've got it all on my own. Thank you, said Goliath, and he puffed up the slope. Maria and Valerie were right behind Goliath. He hoped they weren't following him, but they were, for his own benefit. Goliath arrived to a junction. He looked ahead at the three different tracks that led him to the Easter egg party. One way was the much quicker but much harder way. And the other way was the longer way. Valerie and Maria can't follow me now if I take the shorter way. They're not strong enough. Goliath didn't know was that the rocks were tumbling down the hill from the night before. I shan't be seeing any more of them today, bubbled Goliath. Then there was trouble. Earth and stone tumbled down the hill, hit Goliath's banks and blocked his tracks. Bust my buffers, cried Goliath. I'll have to bash my way through. So he biffed the rocks hard. And again, and again, and was just backing for another try when more rocks hit him. Ouch, said Goliath. Luckily, Valerie and Maria puffed up behind him. We've got it, we've got it, they tooted. Well done, said the fat controller. You've worked fast and you've been quick. I'm proud to have you as my engines. We're proud to be your engines, said Valerie and Maria. And Maria took Goliath back to the sheds.
in disgrace.